My name is Jane. From the day I was born, I was unwanted. My mother was only 16 when she had me and my father was 18. They should have been out having fun and being teenagers, but instead, they were stuck caring for a baby. It made them resent me. They had to work hard to feed me and clothe me. I didn't have grandparents to help out because both of my parents were orphans. From as long as I remember, they treated me like a problem for my parents. When I was old enough to walk, my parents would leave me alone all day with a bowl of soup and a piece of dry toast. I had no toys, so I played with the remote control and books. When our neighbors saw that I was alone, my parents would lie, saying that they had to leave me alone so that they could work. Really, they were going out and having fun. I was happy when I started kindergarten. I was getting good food, and there were real toys to play with. I wore the same clothes to school a lot because they only bought me two shirts and a pair of pants. My teachers said things about it, but I didn't realize that this wasn't normal. After school, I had to sit out on the street, waiting in the cold for my parents to come home. I ended up getting tuberculosis because I was always on the streets in the cold. I had to go to the hospital and I stayed for a long time. I loved it there. I was getting three tasty meals each day. I had a warm bed to sleep in, and for the first time, I saw what it was like for someone to care about me. The doctors and nurses were wonderful. The other kids in the hospital always had their parents there, and even they showed me the love and care that my parents never did. When it was time to go home, I was sad. When I got home from the hospital, everything had changed. My parents had another baby and I had a sister. My parents didn't treat her the way that they treated me. They were really nice to her. Before I went to the hospital, my parents slept in their room and I slept on the couch. When I came home, my sister had the bedroom all to herself and it was beautifully decorated. My parents slept in the living room and I had to sleep on the floor in the kitchen. It really wasn't fair. One day, I finally got the nerve to ask my parents why they hated me, but they treated my sister like a princess. She had beautiful clothes, the best toys, and they always fed her cookies and other delicious sweets. They told me that I wasn't really their child, and I was adopted. One afternoon, my parents took my sister to the circus, but there was no ticket for me. I found a box in the living room with important documents. Finally! I discovered my parents' terrible secret. I saw my birth certificate, and it proved that I was my parents' biological child. It was my sister who was adopted. I found guardianship documents. They said that my sister's father was a rich man who died, and he left all of his money to her. My parents took her in so that they could get their hands on her money. It was then that I realized I would never be treated properly at home. I went to the police station and I asked them to file a report with child services. I wanted to be taken away from my parents. I signed papers saying that I wanted to go to an orphanage. I figured at an orphanage I could have three meals a day, friends, and at least one adult who had to care about me. I would be better off there than at home. Some people may not agree with what I did, but for me, it was the best option. To watch more animated story videos like this, hit that subscribe button and tell us in the comments section what you thought about this story.